Okay, so welcome back to our registered master equation already you know, and the discussion of solve problems. So at this uh, moment, I will try to solve other problem which involve about the uh, effects of temperature in, in resistance. Okay, so now we will have the problem. Okay. So we have this problem. The resistance of a wire is 126.48 ohms at 100 degrees Celsius and 100 ohms at 30 degrees Celsius. Determine the temperature coefficient of copper at 0 degrees Celsius. Okay, so let's have our solution. First, we will get the given. So let's change the and for that, so R1 is equal to 126.48 ohms. Then we have our uh, T1, small t, T1 is equal to 100 degrees Celsius. Then we have our R2. Is equal to um, 100 ohms and our T2 which is equal to 30 degrees Celsius okay so we need to de determine our alpha at 0 degrees okay so we have our r1 and r2 so we can use the formula r2 over r1 is equal to t plus t1 over t plus Okay, this is theta, sorry. T, T2 over T1. So we have all the given, T1, T2, R1, and R2. So we can solve for our T, okay? So how to solve for T? So we'll just substitute our given. Okay, so let's put that on this side. As it should be given, so we have our R2 is equal to 100 ohms over our R1 is 126.48 ohms. This is equal to T, so that is the one that we are trying to get plus our T2 is 30 degrees Celsius and we have also T plus T1 is 100 degrees Celsius okay so we will now solve for T of course we could use our ship salt so let's bring here our calculator so we have 100 over 126.48. Oops, sorry, sorry. Equals. Oh, okay. Alpha equals. So we'll make our T as our X so that we can shift solve for X. And alpha X plus 100 so shift solve so shift solve then equals okay equals then we have 234.35 so our answer is 234 again point 0.35 point 0.35 degrees Celsius now we 
we know that our alpha or the temperature coefficient at zero degrees is equal to the reciprocal of our absolute temperature. So this is one over P. So we have one over two hundred thirty four point thirty five degree Celsius so we could have that one as a 1 over 234.35 so this is equivalent to uh, that is 4.27 4.27 times 10 to the power of negative 3 ohms or you could um, make this as a decimal so this negative 3 so you move your decimal point to the left 3 times 1, 2, 3 so you will have 2 zeros before the 4 so 0 that is the whole number so then you have two zeros before the four. Zero, zero, four, twenty-seven ohms. And this is now our answer. Okay. So that is for the video on another example, the effects of temperature in resistance. So thank you for watching. I hope you learned something. And as always, keep studying.